Howdy everyone, welcome back to another video today, and today we're going to do a little video of a little haul from where I went to the Lego Ninjaga movie Toy the Run event at Toy the Run today. I just said Toy the Run twice, I don't know why, sorry, I'm, I'm a bit tired. <laughs> but I also watched the Lego Ninjaga movie as well today, so I will do a whole separate review on that in a different video. But now we are doing the little haul, where I got two Lego Batman and mystery pack, three Lego Ninjago mystery pack, and the Ninjago City of Chase. That's 70607, 233 pieces, pieces, ages 7 to 14, and I also got a little thing right here, so we're gonna show this off first. So pretty much it's like a little temple sort of, it has a little bit of foliage up in front, and it even has a little Oh, uh, gold crystal in the back. So it had like little, I guess they're supposed to represent windows and that sort. So yeah. We're gonna start with the Lego Batman pop. Let's start with that. Let's see what we get. We got Commissioner Gordon. Who I already had him, by the way. But good thing we got him, cause I kind of like the figure, honestly. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Has a little radio and a little wanted Joker sign on it. Here he is. Had a little, I guess, office suit printing or something on the front. Nothing that big on the back. Just a little tad bit of printing. No printing on the side or the back. But he does have a little badge and all that sort up here. And I think there might be a little holster or something in the front as well. Let me just double check that. It came with everything. Yep, it did. That's good. Okay, so there's pack number one. Here's pack number two. Yeah. Oh, we got a new one. A calculator. One I haven't I haven't gotten yet, but now I do have it. So that's cool. Before I show the other stuff on the helmet, here's this little head right here. We also show the torso printing well. I can get that off. There we go. We have a little torso print on the front. Just showing a little bit of ad and all that and such. And yeah. Here's a little printing on the leg. They got some print on the side, which I'm guessing these are little calculator buttons or something. So yeah. And then on here, he got the little calculator, which I believe goes this way. Yep. There's a little calculator piece, I'm guessing. <clears throat> and he also comes with a helmet that has... Hello on it. It says hello. That's pretty cool. I'm glad to get him, because I only have one... Uh, two, three, four, four left to get, I think. Yeah, four left. I just need to get Barbara Gordon in her police outfit. Barbara Gordon in the little pink bat tutu thing. 
and Richard Grayson with the shark repellent, which I really wanted to get to bad. And King Tut. So yeah, that's the Lego Batman movie pack. Now we're moving on to Lego Ninjago. Let's see which ones we get. Well, we got one I really wanted. Because they come with a mace piece, which I really like. This one that I believe is the, uh, I want to say the anglerfish person, whatever. Here's a little, I don't know, here's a little torso and leg printing. Nothing on the side and nothing on the back. And it comes with this little, I want to say just some, like to help them breathe underwater and all that. Pretty cool thing, I might say so myself. And here is the head. You know, on the back. And here is the helmet mold, which is an anglerfish, which I really like. It's pretty cool because it's all rubbery and all that. And I believe it also comes with comes with a fish and my favorite part of this honestly is the mace because I can use that for a little project I'm working on if you know what I'm talking about so yeah a little angler I'm guessing it's the uh, general or whatever on to the next one Oh, we got Lloyd. We got Lloyd, the Green Ninja. Yay. And his head is already in here. But, uh, how do you put this on? Okay, I see now. I, how do you do this? I don't know. Oh, here we go. I found it. Never mind. He comes with his little, let me show you the little, um, front, head printing, first. The little head printing right there. No back one. Here's a little torso right here. Printing on the arms and some on the back. And none under the arms either. But he does come with his hair as well. But he also comes with his helmet as well too. So if you want to switch him out, well. There he is with his hair. And I'm going to use the one with his helmet. Or his ninja hood. Or whatever you want to call it. There's a little light printing right there as well. I don't think you can see that. A little bit of green, nothing on the side and nothing on the back. He also comes with a little sword, which I like with what they're doing with this new technique. Where they have this little piece on the bottom of the sword, which just dangles basically. And I really love this little thing. It's sort of like, it starts to sort of be like a brush, I guess. Something like that. And so, yeah. And he also comes with little plans of his little mech dragon, I believe. So, yeah. There's Lloyd Garmadon. Without his hair on. And so, yeah. And the last pack. Now let's see what we get in this one. Yeah. 
And we got uh, the rocker dude, which I don't know his name. I forget his name, honestly. If you want to comment down below what his name is, please do so. Here's a little rock dude. I think he might have seen him in one of my other reviews and all that such. But yeah. Alright. Gonna get to building the little Ninjago City Chief. I'm gonna do that real quick. Alright, and I now finished the Lego Ninjago City Chief. Here are the figures. Come with a little shopkeeper. He screaming. No printing, but on the back. I like a little tree dirt thing, I think. He had a little $100 bill. Here is Nia with a little cell phone. There's her printing on the front. None on the side. But there are some on the back for her torso. Here's Lloyd, who comes with a little set of hop or whatever you want to call it. Here's the little printing on the front, none on the side, and one for the little hood on the back, which I wish they added the little piece that they have with it as well, but they didn't, sadly. Here's a little cup. Come with handcuffs and a little, uh,. I forget the name here from the original Lego movie, but the cop and that the bad cop or whatever. He would play by Liam Neeson, I believe. No printing on the side and none on the back. Or there are there's some on the back, my bad. And it's like a little radio. Yeah. And here is the little goon who is whole who has a little eye patch and a little orange hat. And he has a fish with a Thor's hammer on it. Here's the printing on the front. Not on the side. But there's some on the back of the torso. So yeah. Now I get that out of the way. We're gonna get to the actual set itself. It comes with a little pulley, little car bike thing, I guess. You can drive around. Pretty cool. Might say it to myself. A little barrel, a little sort of barrel of apples, or whatever you want to call it. And the apple fell out. Here is like a little... I want to say it's just like little street stuff, I don't know. They had like some little Ninjago words on it and that such. And a little light on and all that. So yeah. But the main part of this whole thing go to the shop itself on it. I don't know what it says, but they sell fish and cherries, as you can tell from the little sign. And so yeah, that's about to wrap it up. I'll see y'all guys in the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. That'll help out the channel a bunch. And I will post a Ninjago, Lego Ninjago movie review and a little probably tomorrow or so. So yeah. I'll catch you guys later. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I'll help the channel a bunch. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.